The Large Hadron Collider, a 17-mile superconducting machine designed to smash protons together at close to the speed of light, went offline overnight. Engineers investigating the mishap found the charred remains of a furry creature near a nod-through power cable. Mark, what I'm hinting at here... What did it look like? ...is that this $7 billion piece of machinery was basically sabotaged by a weasel. A real weasel. A real one. They found the charred remains of this poor, poor creature that looks something like this. So what happened to oh, it? Why is it charred? It gnawed through some cables and probably got electrocuted oh. with like 10 billion volts of electricity and shot away. So they spent $17 billion on a collider and they, it's not weasel protected? It's not weasel proof. Uh. It's, it's not. Uh, this is uh, something that they were, they were basically preparing to collect new data on the Higgs boson, mm -hmm. right? Which I'm sure you're familiar with. The researching, basically what they're trying to do is they're trying to recreate the Big Bang Theory in this big machine, and they're gonna prove that God doesn't exist. That's basically what it boils down to. And of course, people at the place where I work with, they love it. They just chew it up, they think this is great. They think this is the greatest thing in the world. Um, and I'm telling you that this thing is straight from hell. Um, you know, when the children of men builded the Tower of Babel, the Bible says here that God came down to look at it. That's what it says. It says that, the, that God came down to look at it. Now, now, before I get off on that, I just want to show you the logo here. I printed out a picture. This is the logo, right? Anybody see anything odd about this? Yeah, you see the sixes? Yeah. You know, and, and they don't even try to hide it, you know. It, it's, it's satanic. Here's their corporate mascot. So this is uh, some guy named Shiva, or some female, some stupid goddess named Shiva that's doing the dance of destruction. That's their mascot. So what do you think they're about? Look, I don't need to know anything more than that. That right there settled. Just the fact that work was telling me it was a good thing, actually, was enough for me. And uh, I got something kind of funny here. So with the, the Tower of Babel, God came down and visited it. Right, but listen to this. So, so by the way, this thing here is huge. This thing has the largest machine in the world, right? And, and, and it's buried underground, and people are claiming they're seeing, you know, I don't know, ghosts or the devil. A lot of people think that this is um, Apollyon or Abdon in the Bible, and this is going to open up the gates of hell, and we're about to be out of here soon, but that's not true. Read Revelation chapter 9, okay? This is not Apollyon. This is garbage. So I got a news article here from uh, BBC. It says, the largest scientific experiment has gone offline because of a foreign intruder. CERN's Large Hadron Collider, the world's biggest particle accelerator located near Geneva, Switzerland, lost power Friday. Engineers who were investigating the outage made a grisly discovery. The charred remains of a weasel. The dark woods of Transylvania are home to an insatiable serial killer. Their long, flexible bodies allow them to pursue their prey almost anywhere. The weasel's powerful jaw thrusts sharp canines through the prey's skull. Retreating to his burrow, the weasel scarfs down the victim's brains giving him a burst of energy. Talk about brain food. But he immediately heads back out. The compulsion to kill propels him back to the hunt. <laughs> CERN spokesman Arnaud um, Marsolier told uh, BBC, the, the little critter gnawed through a 66 kilovolt transformer inside an electrical facility outside the main building. Just for perspective, one kilovolt is 1,000 volts of energy. Chewing the wiring ended up frying the creature into oblivion and causing a wide power outage around CERN, the European Organization for Nuclear Research. The unexpected power losses shut down the Large Hadron Collider for at least a week as engineers worked to make repairs and address other issues, uh, the spokesman said. I know that Stephen Hawking has said that the, that the collider itself is a danger to mankind because it could create a black hole that could destroy the Earth, right? We are smashing protons and stuff at very high so, speeds. So, don't you think it's possible that scientists in the future have managed to find a hole in the space-time continuum? They sent back a weasel to sabotage the collider to save the Earth? This is a, a, a weasel from the future who's yeah, saving mankind. Yeah, is this a future weasel? So look, 
With the Tower of Babel, God came down and visited it. With this stupid thing, God sent a weasel. They got shut down for a week uh, for, with it by a stupid weasel. God's like, I'm not coming down there. I've already seen this. This is weak. Okay? You got shut down by a weasel. A weasel. Look, there's millions and billions of dollars and euros and yens and all kinds of currencies that go into this thing. Just about every country under the sun has some part in this CERN. Even the Palestinian Authority has something there. Right? Of course, Israel's a big player. Uh, Rockefeller University sends their scientists there. Like, I don't know. I'm not even going to claim to note to, to teach this to you or to even you know, understand it. I don't really care. I'm not afraid of it. They're not going to blow up the world. They might blow up Geneva, Sw you know, Switzerland. They might blow up France. You know, they might blow a lot of people up. Who knows? I don't really care. Because I just want to see people saved. I just want to preach God's word. I just want to exercise the gifts that God has given me. And I want to help and edify all of you and any other brother in Christ that I run across. That's what I care about. I don't care about some stupid magnetic atom smasher that's going to, you know, change the face of technology as we know it. Shut up. You got, like I said, you got dropped by a weasel. 